My friend Jeff is an addict. It is really hard admitting that your brother is an addict. I don't see what the big problem is. All he cares about now is when he's going to get his next fix. Jeff used to be really cool. Uh, he used to hang out with us, and he was really funny and popular, and he did good in school. And then all of a sudden, he just got really weird. There's so much more to life than, you know, living day to day, looking for your next fix. He's not home as much these days, and my friends at school are like telling me they see him on the streets and stuff. Sleeping in alleyways, like what kind of life is that? So what if I'm homeless? I'm fine. He just sleeps in the weirdest places, and when you bother him, he gets really grumpy. <laughs> Mom and Dad said they're gonna kick you out if you don't stop this addiction. Yeah, so. You do. Yeah, so. Yeah, so. He goes out and buys his stuff in the creepiest of places. It's not safe for him. It's dangerous. I just like knitting. I'm sorry that it's fun, but I enjoy doing it. Jeff, you have a problem. No, I don't. You're addicted. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. Shut up! I'm not addicted. understand what he's doing. It's dangerous. He goes dumpster diving. You know, just my brother and I and I love him. And it's it's really hard to see someone who's just like he was so well liked at school. His looks changed and he just seems I don't know, really different. I don't know what it is, man. The feel of the needle in my fingers. The feel of yarn in my hand. I just love knitting. I don't know what the big deal is. It really hurts seeing the way Jeff shut us out of his life. 